crispy skin salmon Ooh. with a pureed Japanese sweet potato okay. and my ridiculous radicchio and citrus salad. Mm, Deal with that. So we're gonna get going, starting with the potatoes. I am using the Japanese sweet potato. So I'm gonna grab my little sauce pot, three tablespoons of butter, and a half cup of heavy cream. And that's gonna be like my water. Wow. to boil these potatoes. Any little brown spots, shave off, right? It's gonna be as pretty as it is delicious. Just pinch it like this and then, all right, cut it in half. Now we're gonna cut these kind of into like dices, right? About quarter inch. I think that is oh so plenty. And quick, boom. Just salt. You wanna bring it to a simmer? You don't want to scald it. Nice, gentle simmer here. This is not like a mashed potato. This is going to be a puree where a little will go a, a very long way. Now let's go on to our beautiful radicchio and orange salad here. I always start with the Dijon. This is just the most magical thing. In my apple cider vinegar, just a couple glugs of that, about a half a shallot. You want this minced. That's plenty right in there. Now things are happening. I'm going to hit it with, of course, a pinch. Lovely, we have an orange. We are going to supreme this. Same spelling as supreme. We are going to take our chef's knife and making these little kind of slices, follow the natural curve of the orange to remove the pith and expose that juicy fruit right in there. Essentially what we're doing is segmenting the orange. So now we have this beautiful, juicy, pure orange. I'm gonna take my paring knife and I'm gonna follow that membrane with these two V cuts. And what we're gonna do is let it fall into that. And we're left with this. Wow. A supreme. Slice, slice, a clean supreme. Do this over a glass bowl. I'm gonna take that, take this juice. Oh. Why waste it, right? Now, the radicchio. Pretty color. Now we can have it. We're gonna try to get as dainty as possible here. A couple of these leaves. I'm just gonna pick the choicest ones out of here. Something like that is that's pretty, pretty. That's right? beautiful. Beautiful little radiques, little watercress, all that stuff ready to go. Check this. You wanna make sure you scrape the bottom, scrape the sides every time you stir. Now I'm working quick. Our salmon, you know what? First things first, season it with salt. Now I'm gonna take my knife and I'm going to have this. Slide my knife, season both sides. And I'm gonna let it lay on the skin side. Check my taters. I'm gonna actually shut them down. We got an immersion blender, which we haven't used yet. So I'm gonna take this, right? We got two buttons, high, low. And we're just gonna oh, literally wow. kind of stab it a little bit. Not overworking it, because these can get gluey. You know, and then I tilt the pan a little bit to get more volume. And I'm good with that. Usually it's a presentation side going on first. We're not gonna do that this time. Medium to low heat to really render that subcutaneous layer of salmon fat under the skin. Now I'm gonna take my olive oil. We're gonna stream in while whisking to help emulsify the oil in the vinegar. I'm gonna do this slowly while whisking. I'm looking, what do you think, yeah? And Such it's more no. longer. Yeah. I'm gonna get my mise en place ready for when we do flip it. Couple smashed garlic, tablespoon of butter, couple sprigs of thyme. All right, I'm gonna flip it now. Just like that. Gentle. Now I'm gonna take that butter and just let it slowly kind of melt in between these guys. We're just gonna kind of perfume this with some garlic and herb. And do we want to get that golden? All right, I'm gonna take some of my choicest leaves. Beautiful watercress, that's a pretty one. So I'm gonna take my clean plate, beautiful radicchio. Right, this is tweezer food. Oh my God, do you actually have tweezers? Oh, <sighs> Now this is when the artistry comes into play. I mean, listen, you don't want to cover anything up and you want to kind of follow the flow of the plate. So cute. Oh, how beautiful. Truly. Now we got our puree, tip down. Okay. Thick boys. That's where the salmon's gonna live. I love this. So now you're gonna take your finest piece of salmon, give me its best 
Look, look at that. Look what just happened. After Yum, I shiny. It. I mean, come on. 